Hi there, Ginny again, and this time I'm doing another ATC, again with the, um, the theme being texture. That's the, the first one I made. Um, this one I'm thinking I'd like to paint the background first. Um, I might use some different colours. I might use a bit of purple. Um, hmm. I'm not really sure. Um, oh, I know what I forgot to do on that one. I was supposed to do something else on this one. If you've seen the other video, um, with the bands of colour, I was supposed to go over and mute the lines of those with a bit of white paint so that it blended better. But that's how it is. <laughs> that's how it's turned out. All right. So this time I will just do a bit of a. Bit of a um, I don't know. A different background. I'm just guessing as I'm going along. <laughs> maybe oh I don't, forgot to get a bit of water um, what else what else what else a bit of green can't pass up green, I love green. My favourite colour. So the wind started up again. A little bit of dappled light from the trees. Oops. Alright. Um, So what I want to do with this one to create the texture this time is glue on, sorry about the crinkly noise, I know it's very loud, I think I'm gluing on some lace because, um, get rid of that noise a bit, because when you've glued that down onto paper, that gives a really great texture. It's sort of crunchy and yeah, I think it looks really nice as well as feels nice to touch. I might very quickly blast this paint dry. I will do that. Um, mute, mute the colours down a bit with a bit of white first. This, um, this tube of paint is done I think. <laughs> Finished another one. Now what did I do with the brush? There it is. Oh I've got some circles on there. They actually don't look bad. <laughs> I might do that. There you go. Happy accident as they say. Some more circles on there. Not that you're going to see them that well, but look at that. <laughs> A bit of fun. Ooh. 
people walking past, talking, making a noise, and swearing. Hopefully you didn't hear that. <laughs> any rude language on my videos thank you all right another quick zap wow i don't know if you can see that but the the paint has a really good um in that circle there there's a really great little pattern and it's textural how about that <laughs> it's added more texture without me intending to now if i cover that i'm not going to see much of it Oops. Um, <clears throat> maybe I could put little pieces of lace here and there rather than cover the whole thing. What do you think about that? Well, I might look to see what other laces I have in here. Sorry about the noise. Dump it all out quickly. Oh, that's a bit too thick. You can see through that. Oh, I don't like that one. Ah, there's a thin piece. That's better. Because you can still see the background through it. Do I have any more of this? Yes. I think that's it. So just scrappy bits of lace. I think that's it for that one. So I might cut them up into different bits. And that's a different one altogether. Just sort of fiddling around trying to decide what and where. No, hang on, this piece. Yep, that'll do. Quickly, quickly. Oh, I just tipped something over under the desk. This room is a gigantic pigsty at the moment. I've chucked things all over the place. It's going to have quite a job cleaning it up afterwards. Oh, what's going on with the camera? No, it's okay. It's all right. Too much glue. Hmm. Yep, yeah. I'm going to cover up that pretty circle. Oh well. I suppose I could add another one. I have no idea what I'm going to do next on this. <laughs> no idea. Alright, quickly put this away. Stop my chair from creaking. Give this a quick dry. Alright, oh, it still feels wet. It's going to take a long time, I think. I might hop off camera and dry it because 
even speed it up that's going to take too long so back soon okay so I've dried it up now and um, it does have a really nice feel to it so I've been thinking about it and I've got out a couple of stencils and I'm thinking of doing some modeling paste on that to sort of add to the background um, and you know give some more texture so I'm hoping given that this is fairly thin I don't know that I'm going to get much of a great um, Uh, I don't know what I'm saying. Sorry. <laughs> I don't know if this is going to work all that well. But I will give it a try. Uh, the problem is that the different... Um, the lace kind of holds it up off the paper. Well, I'll give it a try. And if it's a total disaster... I will have to try and either fix it or scrape it off. We'll see. This is where we do a little chant. Please work, please work. <laughs> Being it works over the top of the lace. That'd be nice. Oops. Uh, fingers crossed. Mm. The one on the paper worked really well. <laughs> on the lace it's gone all blotchy. Oh well. So that adds to the texture. <laughs> now, hmm, clean that off on my drop paper. It's actually quite nice. Um, Alright, so I'm just going to switch off for a sec so I've got to go and wash that straight away before it dries and gets yucky. Alright that's done and I've dried this off. <clears throat> um, so what I'm thinking I might do next is um, do a flower up around here and for that I want to use the tissue paper again. Um, break a piece of So yeah, I might I'll crump, crump a little around. And I want to make a flower head out of this. If I can, after I've done the flowers, maybe put a little butterfly maybe on there with that stencil. But focus on this for the moment. So do the um, stem with tissue paper as well.
hopefully I'll um, be able to keep you know a lot of crinkles in this as well like I did with the background of the first OTC I did <coughs> And hopefully it will stick down. It keeps wanting to um, come off again. Okay, I just had to change the memory card. Um, Alright, so I've got a little stem worked out. Oops, it's a bit tricky to do this. <coughs> Alright, I'm just going to dry that off and I'll be back. Okay, so it's dry now. Got some little bits hanging off that sort of look like leaves. Just cut that excess off. And now I'm thinking of putting some colour on. So dark green for the flower stem Need to get the paint down into the lid that's good Problem with colouring that you can't see the texture as well. I might um, <clears throat> do what I did before on the other one. Just give it a bit of highlight with a different colour later on. center <clears throat> mm, some of that's still a bit wet I'm wondering if I have a different 
colour. I'll just have to search through my paints here. Magenta would be alright, wouldn't it? Nice and bright. <clears throat> mm. Oh, yeah, that's very strong, very bright. Too crash hot at the moment. <laughs> Hopefully, I'll be able to fix it so it looks a bit better than this. <clears throat> All right. Um, let's scrub this paint off. I think I'll dry this up again. Mm, that's better. It's 100% dry. No, I'll just. Um, a bit of gold, I think. Bit of metallic gold. Try and bring out that texture a bit better. <clears throat> Need these leafy bits not to curl up so much. It's not showing up as well as I'd like it to. I don't think I creased this um, this part well enough. So, what can I do on the flower? Maybe a darker metallic. Maybe use this bronze again. <coughs> this paint's very thick. So I tried to tap it into the lid, but it doesn't happen. Oh, I've got too much there now. I think this worked better on the background that I did on the other ATC. It's not working that great here. Try and put some in there as well.
Alright. Might stick those down. We like to see craft glue. Oh, there it is. Smushed it. Come back here, naughty leaf. Not really happy with that either. All right, so. I really need something else. I'll think about it. I might add some beads to it maybe. Right, I'm gonna have a go at doing the butterfly stencil thing. I want a smallish one. <coughs> Maybe that one. Again, it's pretty tricky on the lace. Don't know how well it's going to work. Gee, I've made a mess. A lot of cleaning up to do after this. that down well enough. Got a feeling this texture paste is not going to be kind to this stencil. <laughs> I'll have to wash it off straight away. I think. in there to make a good enough impression. Fingers crossed. Hmm. Not perfect. I don't know if you can see that. I'll put some colour on it so it should um, stand out more. Give this stencil a quick wipe. If I can get a bit on this, it's gone a bit too crunchy. A bit of water. Oh yeah, comes off alright. It's come off really well. So that's fine. Missing the um, the detail in the, the little bottom wing. Now I'll um, I'll switch off and dry this quickly. Okay, back again. After drying that, I'm going to paint this little butterfly with some purple metallic paint.
It's a little bit hard to see. I would normally have this up close to my face, I think. Need to see where his wings going. Sorry I'm being so quiet. I don't really have a lot to talk about today. Nothing much has been going on, apart from me not feeling very well and headachey, but you know, that's <laughs> normal for me. There's nothing much else been happening. Mm. <coughs> This little butterfly, not looking all that great. Yeah, it kind of makes it look like it's flat now rather than raised up. It's a bit of a shame. I should go over those leaves that I put on first. with some copper I think copper copper oops a bit of water doesn't help Things. That came off my brush, it's still a bit wet on the handle. happy with this card the way it's going I wanted it to be a lot better shows the um that the leaf stencil didn't do very well <sighs> no not happy with that at all Might have 
to have another go at doing it differently. 